Say, uh, Jason Magic, you know I do a trick? Do you? It's called making goat cheese ravioli disappear. Hey, you can have my serving too. Not Who doesn't love a magical night out filled with laughter and a few surprises? And when that includes filling up on a fabulous Italian family meal, what more do you need? Our friend Jason Magic can deliver on all points. He's got a show this Saturday at our favorite, Janitti's Hole in a Wall, in the wall, I should say, in Northville, Janitti's. We will get to your big show in a moment. First, uh, how did you get started in magic? Uh, was it Doug Henning or David Copperfield? It was uh, actually Harry Blackstone. Really? Yes. The, the OG guy? Yeah, I got a magic kit uh, for my birthday. It was fantastic, and uh, it, it stuck. Who'd have thought, right? What do you love about it? What do I love? It's, it's people trying to figure it out. Like this, the Rubik's Cube puzzle. Yep. Was I not supposed to do that? Really, Jason Carr? <laughs> really? Really? This is why we don't have nice things. No, I'm just kidding. Look at the face. Look at the look on your face. I love it. That's it's a joke. We're not, we're not, we weren't doing anything with the Rubik's Cube. I just I pre-read the oh monitor God. earlier and it said, so what do you like about it? I just wanted to do that. It took me eight hours to do. <laughs> this gets down to some tricks. <laughs> You know, magicians I thought didn't like to refer to illusions or whatever as tricks because they're illusions. Yeah, that's an arrested development term. That, that goes way back. No, here, no, I like to look at it as a moment in time to, I don't know what I'm talking about. No, here, I'll do a trick. I'll do right, it. Right. I got an you, easy you one. You always have something up your sleeve. Okay, sleep. all right. So this is my deck of cards. Uh, it's got rubber bands on it, two rubber bands. That's just to remind me that my kids are waiting for me in the car. <laughs> and uh, I'm kidding, people, I'm kidding. They're not my kids. <laughs> <laughs> That's all it takes. We hang all the time. No, all right, so this is going to be your deck of cards, okay? Okay. So I'm just going to just, you know, let the, the audience peruse through those, okay? Now, they're in no special order, okay? I'll even shuffle them up. doesn't really matter. All I want you to do, it's going to take an hour to fix that. Just uh, the look on your face, though. Push forward any card, any card you want. And I want you to name it. Just name a card, any card out loud. Just name it out loud. Uh, five of spades. Would that freak you out if that was the five of spades? I would be take, dumb, take, I would be take a look. I would have freaked out too. <laughs> I would have freaked out too. It's the three of clubs. It is the three of clubs. But the thing with magic is people want to figure out how these uh, tricks are done. But are they tricks or are they just meant to happen? Look, my deck of cards had the rubber bands on it. If I open these up very slowly here, because I don't want you to think I'm, I'm cheating, but I picked a card too. If you take a good look here, let's just go ahead and put it right there. And uh, t take a look at my card, if you don't mind. This Let's is from your deck. That That's from my band. deck, and this was the one that was from your deck. You picked the three of clubs, so right? So you're, you're telling me this is going to be the five of spades. I'm saying that would be amazing if that was the five of spades, but it's not. It's the same card that you picked. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, and you just don't know when it's going to happen until it happens. It's such a good trick. They started applauding before I even turned the card over. I know. Everybody left already. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. So what else do you want to know, Jason Carr? Tell us about this magical evening out in downtown Northville this weekend. It's dinner and a show, and how can people get tickets? By the way, I love this place. It's family style. You go in, you sit down, you have a family style Italian meal. They, the, the portions are insane. And then you go next door into a, like a small auditorium theater, and he's your entertainment. Tell us more about it. What else can you uh, ask yeah, about for? About 30 it? seconds. Okay, so it's, uh, it's a comedy magic show. They gear it for like 13 and up. So if you got little kids, leave them in the car. Ah, just kidding. <laughs> um, get a sitter, spend the money. And um, yeah, I've got a, I got a show coming up uh, New Year's Eve, next January. There's always a show on Genetis.com uh, to promote it. And really, you think I've never done this before, but I didn't get all the information. I'll call the theater for tickets. Genetis. It's uh, G-E-N-I-T-T-I, -T -T right? That's Gen it. Genetis. Com. All right. Jason Magic, everybody. Good to see you, my friend. Oh, I love you. Absolutely. Tati.